and I could tell that she was just scared to death of me, of what I might do. It was like a knife in my heart and me. You know, ever, ever since I really started thinking that she could be alive, I had this fantasy in my head that the first time that we saw each other again, we'd be so happy. And I find her under a bunch of rubble. And I thought I'd lost her again. And then she makes it to the surgery, and I can't wait for her to open her eyes and look at me. But she's still lost to me. Don't think like that. All right, hey, listen to me. Sierra will get her memory back. And I think I know how to make that happen. And for all the freedom to move their way, diapers. Mom, don't worry. I understand. We will be taking lots of pictures and videos, and I will email them all to you. Yes. I love you too. So how's your mom doing? Uh, she feels so guilty for not being here today. I told her that I understood that her tour was booked a year in advance, but I don't think it helped. Did she explain why Aunt Paulina popped back in your life with no warning? She doesn't have to explain. I know that's just how she is. She swoops on in without a warning, and then she leaves exactly the same way. That could have been easy for you and your liver. I got used to it. My mom said she talked to Auntie Paulina last night and she just kept going on and on how honored she was to be Jules's godmother. Oh boy. Right? Your mom has her work cut out for her. Eli and Lottie do so want me to be Jules' godmother. You heard his speech, you were there. It was about Julie. What? You didn't let him finish. Are you sure? I'm positive. Well, why didn't Lonnie say something? Well, she didn't want to hurt you, Paulina. And you were so excited, and she didn't want to tell it in front of everybody. In, in fact, she was on her way here to tell you herself, but there was so much to do getting ready for the christening. I told her I'd come and talk with you. Mm. But Julie... She's no spring chicken. I mean, how she's gonna how she gonna be Jules' spiritual guide until she's grown up? Well, I, I'm I'm sure that Eli and Lonnie have thought about all that. And they still want her. They do. Thank you, thank you for telling me. Are you all right, sis? <laughs> 